The Bacterium agrobacterium tumefaciens is a natural genetic engineer of a wide variety of plants. The bacterium has a loop of DNA called a tumor-inducing or TI plasmid and can transfer part of this plasmid into a plant cell. The DNA transfer induces plant cells to make food molecules for the bacterium. Agrobacterium, which is ubiquitous in the soil, begins to communicate with plant cells at a wound on the plant body. The wounded plant releases phenolic compounds that, depending on the species involved, agrobacterium recognizes. In the cell envelope, a protein called vir A detects the chemical signal from the wounded plant. The binding activates vir A, which can then activate another protein called vir G through phosphorylation. A number of genes called vir genes are located on the TI plasmid. While the genes encoding vir A and vir G are turned on all the time, the expression of the other vir genes requires activated vir G as a transcriptional activator. Two of the gene products are vir D1 and vir D2. The vir D proteins are endonucleases that cleave at the 25 base pair sequence repeats at the ends of the tDNA. As a result, the cell produces a single-stranded tDNA molecule attached to vir D2 at one end. Vir D2 directs the transfer of the tDNA into a plant cell in a process similar to bacterial conjugation. Within the plant cell nucleus, the tDNA becomes integrated into the plant genome. A number of genes are encoded in the tDNA and become expressed in the plant cell. Some of the gene products are responsible for the synthesis of the plant hormones cytokinin and auxin which trigger the plant cells to divide rapidly and form an undifferentiated mass known as a crown gall tumor. The tDNA also encodes genes that control the production of unusual amino acid derivatives called opines. In return for delivering the tDNA to the plant, the bacterium gets the opines as a source of carbon and nitrogen. Researchers in play agrobacterium to genetically engineer a wide variety of plants. In this procedure, the tDNA is placed on another plasmid that is more easily manipulated, and the DNA between the flanking sequence repeat regions is replaced with a gene of interest. Upon infection, the virulence system induces transfer of the tDNA to the plant cell without any tumor-inducing genes allowing genomic integration of the recombinant gene without tumor induction or opine production.